My name is Serbi Mandata and I'm a senior at Olympia High School. So in ninth grade I actually conducted an experiment um, where I developed an alternative treatment for a fungal pathogen and that was better than uh, standardized pharmaceuticals. So that got me qualified for a science fair, um, the Intel International Science and Engineering Fair. So seeing lots of other students with a similar passion and um, just interest in research really motivated me to continue science and research. So that's one thing that inspired me to um, develop uh, my help for um, helping with people's impaired hand movements. When we first talked, she had this idea of what she wanted to do. And I was just kind of nodding my head like, yeah, that sounds really great. But not really absorbing her level of dedication to it. And so as she kind of checked off each of the different areas that she needed to do, I kept being more and more convinced that she was going to be able to finish it because I really, I mean, her passion was great, but I wasn't even sure that the proof of concept was there. And so as she continued to do the work and pull threads together and really develop something that's really significant and really amazing that uh, a young person, one, had the vision to do it and then the hard work and dedication to make it possible. So uncontrolled hand movements and um, tremors are very commonly seen problems in millions of people, from people that are healthy to people who have diseases like Parkinson's and cerebral palsy. So I developed a system called MyHelp that consists of a glove and an armband. What the glove does is um, it can assist with impaired hand movements by helping close the hand faster and helping improve grip to hold objects. As well as this glove can help control tremors using these structures that are on the top and bottom of the glove. And then this armband can detect and monitor the tremors. So it can monitor the tremor data quantitatively based on different sensors in the armband, as well as it can um, it can help the user identify when they have tremors. Her project is incredibly complicated. There's electronics involved, there's pneumatics involved, there's the 3D modeling. Um, she had to program the, um, she actually built the hardware board. And so she had to pull all these different threads together. Serbi's just uh, one of those students that's very pleasant, that always got a smile on her face, uh, yet she's one of our hardest workers and really dedicated to uh, the field of science. The fact that engineering could be used to solve medical problems is that whole aspect of combining computer science, electronics, design. That was really cool and a lot of fun to do. There's kind of this weird duality about Serbi. When you see her, she seems very um, maybe even timid or humble, but then when she starts talking about it, she talks about it with such authority and with such passion that y you can't help but get kind of swept up into the story that she's telling. One really exciting opportunity this gave me was um, the White House Frontiers Conference. Uh, which was um, a conference about different tech, like different fields in science, and how to tackle these issues and like new innovations in them. And this was in um, this was co-hosted by President Obama, and just hearing him speak about young people in science and um, encouraging girls in STEM, especially, was extremely encouraging and probably one of the most like memorable experiences I've had. A lot of our students are driven by the grades and the points, and I think it's great to see somebody who's just got kind of that social consciousness saying what the things that she do can make a difference in the world around her and I think that's what's special about her is that a lot of her passion is driven intrinsically and that's what you want in all of our students to be intrinsically interested in, in what they're doing and she's got that passion so I'm very confident she's going to be successful. To see her go through this whole process of pulling all these different ideas and different threads together and with all this hard work then to actually see how that transformed into uh, this young woman who has a huge amount of charisma and is so knowledgeable and can really talk in depth about what she's doing. It's just amazing and really convincing.